What's up guys, this is Cody here, and today I'm going to be going over the top 25 repos or sources for Cydia. So these are basically all the repos that I have installed, and I do this just because I want to get a good feel of everything that's out there. And there's actually some more repos that you could install, but I just keep it down to around, I actually have about 30 or so that I'm going to show you, I'm just going to label this video as 25. But basically, I just have all these just in case something shows up, maybe a developer is working on something and they upload it to their personal repo, then I'm actually going to get an update showing that this is a new tweak that I can install and try out, maybe it's a beta or something like that. So we're going to have quite a few, almost all of these are personal developer repos. So let's just go ahead and jump right in. So you can see right here in our first repo, this is basically why I installed this was for diet bar. So it makes the navigation bars skinnier or slimmer or anything like that. Uh, as we scroll down, you guys obviously know about Big Boss. We also have Charlie Hewitt's repo. This is the repo that I actually get messages customizer from. So if you guys install this one, I don't think this one's actually working on 8.3. This is the only one that's working. So you definitely want to check that out if you're trying to customize your messages. Coming down here, we also have Coolstar's repo. He always has a whole lot of really awesome tweaks for you to check out. This is usually a beta. Uh, most of his mainstream stuff obviously has been pushed to Big Boss repo. But you can always go through here. You can see what he's working on or what's... Uh, basically in the graveyard there coming down here. We also have CP digital dark rooms uh, Repo that you can go through he has a ton of tweaks in here that you can check out for yourself There's quite a few that I actually downloaded This is the guy that actually developed a uh, hide me 8 light and hide me 8 pro Obviously we have Cydia or sorts repo right there. This is another developer right down here I installed this one for Sicarius. I remember I think this one's actually got me been pushed to the uh, big boss repo we also have cc controls right up there i don't know if that's on big boss or not coming down here we also have db king so if we open this up you can actually see how these are all uh sectioned off but basically this is going to be a whole lot of fonts and we have one theme right here that you can check out but you can see how these are all kind of set up so this is mostly just a font repo and then we also have elijah and andrews so if we open that up you can see i actually installed this for i believe reach app but of course that's still on big boss repo if you guys want to download that again a lot of these sources are actually going to be you know where they put their betas before they actually push it to the big boss but again i know a lot of you guys like to check out the betas so this is going to be a good way to actually you know get those updates when they actually push a beta to one of these repositories so right here we also have a couple of tweaks we have a call recorder and super recorder i think i use super recorder i don't really remember uh either one of those you can check that out if you want to we also have the hashbang productions tweaks that we all have right here. You guys are probably familiar with Hashbang. Uh, we have the Flag Paint 2, which was also a really cool tweak. Coming back here, you can go into Ian's repo. I think I actually have a tweak installed. Oh no, I don't, but I actually wanted to install rounded switcher cars to see if that worked. You can see right here, it's not confirmed to work on iOS 8, but I'll install this just to see uh, once I'm done here. Uh, if we go back here, we also have whatever that word is, repository. And you can see there's quite a few. I haven't been in this repo for quite some time, so I'm not sure. We also have iDevice Hype. This actually has a ton of widgets and themes, as you can see right here, a bunch of themes, a bunch of widgets, and these are actually all free. So if you guys wanna go through here and just download some stuff, check it out, then definitely do so. I mean, this is, I mean, it's all free, so you can just check out the screenshot, see if you wanna check it out, and if you do, then you can just download it. We also have iPhonix, so if we open that up, you can see there's quite a few packages in here. We have almost 150 that you can go through here and check out. A lot of these are iOS 7 tweaks, but again, you can look through these and see if there's anything that looks interesting. A lot of it's beta stuff, but if we go back here again, we can see that we have Karen's Pineapple Repo. This is a really good developer, it makes a lot of really good stuff. So if you go through here, you can see there's quite a few different things. This is Mobile Terminal, which I actually use other than the iOS Terminal that you guys will normally see. Uh, there's quite a few different things that you can download here that actually work and right here We have mad Catsman's beta repo So you guys have probably heard some of these tweaks like solar or uh, jelly lock right here Coming back. We also have mod my eye you guys know in that one We also have no uh, no one important which I actually need to see if XCon works so XCon actually gives you the ability uh, to keep applications from knowing that you're jailbroken. So sometimes people will have applications that when they open them up, they'll get a little pop-up that says you can't use this application while jailbroken. Well, XCon actually fixes that and allows you to use that particular application. Right in here, we also have uh, some battery text, some LG e text. I actually downloaded this for the Wi-Fi text and I believe the signal text. I had this installed for quite some time, 
back on 8.1.2, which is so last week. Coming back down here, we also have PNRE. Open up tweaks here. We had Blur Paper. This is a tweak that I really like. I actually always keep uh, my my background actually blurred. You can see right here that my background's blurred. But if we jump back here into uh, Cydia, another tweak that I actually used before was Uniformity. Coming back down here, we also have PW5A29's repo. He makes some really good tweaks. He actually made uh, speed intensifier as well. You can see that right there. This is was in my uh, last tweak video, which actually speeds everything up, all the animations. All right down here, we have Reddit's community repo, which can sometimes have some pretty good stuff. If you scroll down here, I mean, there's always some stuff that's, I mean, like gaseous dope. Look at this. This is a dope theme. Let's open that up. Look at that. Pretty sick. But anyways, I mean, there's just stuff on here that you can sometimes go through and maybe you'll find something interesting. Red Panda Dev Repo, this is actually one that was in my uh, last video as well. We have Better 5 Column Home Screen, Better 5 Icon Dock, also Date in Status Bar, which you can see that right there. Uh, coming back down, we have R Petrich, which is Ryan Petrich Repo. Definitely recommend having this. He always updates uh, his betas to here before they actually go live on Big Boss or anything like that. And he has some other tweaks that are in here that actually work that aren't on Big Boss. So maybe some that you haven't used before, like Cask, maybe you haven't even heard of it. There's quite a few different cool things that you can find in his repos. He's a great developer. We also have Tattoos repo coming in here. Uh, what did I download here? Oh, it was Perpetual right here, where basically the lock screen notifications don't remove once you unlock your device. So you have to actually delete those off your screen if you want them to go away. So they're Perpetual. All right, so we're winding down here, but right here we also have TripleCon32. So if we open this up, I believe, yeah, I installed this one for Adventure Time Zeppelin Carrier logos, which I'm actually using right now. You can't see it because I'm in Cydia, but uh, there's quite a few different things in here that you can download, check out a lot of different Zeppelin logos if you guys are having any type of trouble finding that. Uh, coming back out here, we also have Tyler Casson's repo, which obviously has that glorious Mobius tweak right there. So that's where you download that from. Uh, coming down here, we also have Winion's repo. I believe that's how you say that. And this just has themes, and I actually use this for the Cataracts repo. So if you guys saw my what's on my jailbroken device or jailbroken iPhone with like 85 tweaks and a bunch of themes, this is the lock screen tweak that I was using, Cataracts. Pretty sweet looking. Coming down here, we also have the Zod TDD, Mac City, all that good stuff. I also have that 3K repo. This is the one that I tweeted out last night asking you guys to add that and then you could actually download the update for mobile substrate. You actually don't need this uh, repo anymore. I probably will just delete it. You don't need this. And last but not least, we have 46 into beta repository. So if we open that up, you can see this is where we can get Alarmy. We also had CC toggle activator, fudge that bounce, home lock, jelly lock clock, all that good stuff. Kiss my pass. You can delete uh, emails without actually entering the passcode on the lock screen, all that good stuff. This is the one that I actually use, the percent text. It basically just replaces your battery with a percentage rather than the actual number. So this is like, I don't think this is anywhere but this repo. So those are all the sources or all the repos that I have installed on my device. If you wanna check those out, I definitely recommend doing so. It does take a little bit longer if you add a whole bunch of these uh, once you open up Cydia because it does have to refresh those sources every time it opens up. But I know you guys have been asking this for quite some time. I usually don't do just sources videos, but I figured at least a few of you guys would appreciate it. So if you did, make sure you smash that like button again if you guys wanna see more videos on everything jailbreak as well as everything Apple make sure you subscribe. If you guys haven't seen my top 25 free jailbreak tweaks video for iOS 8.3, be sure to check that out. I'll put a link in the description below for you guys so you can kind of get a head start on all those tweaks. All right, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.